Hello guys, good morning! I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Just Dance Live starts tonight. Tonight is the opening, uh, the opening night in Miami. So I'm here. Um, I'm very happy that Just Dance team sent me here so I can come check it out. I can film it. I can show you guys this me in the mirror. <gasps> Whoa! Do 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 do. So I'm so excited. Um, I have a lot of hopes. I am very in the dark about the show, so I'm kind of hoping we see some extremes. I don't think we will, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed anyway because I love the extremes. Um, I'm really, really excited to also do like the live stream and stuff. They're gonna have like a ton of community stuff. They're gonna have the costume set up and people walking around. So I'm so excited. And honestly, it sounds really cheesy, but. I've been playing Just Dance since the first one, since Just Dance 1, and it's crazy to see how far they've come. Like, they used to have to get covers of every song, and now they're like, yeah, we've got Beyonce music, we've got Britney Spears music, we have a live tour going on in the US. Like, I'm, I'm so proud of them and how far they've come. They've, they've definitely come a long way and grown a lot. Um, and yeah, I'm just, I'm so happy to be here. I'm so excited to see the next step of where they're going with all of this. So I'm going to take you guys with me. I'm going to film as much as I can. My arm is already hurting from holding up this camera. It's very, it's very difficult. No wonder I've never done this before. I'm just going to switch arms. <laughs> uh, so opening night tonight is at the Fillmore Theater in Miami. So uh, I'm going to head down there now. I'm going to grab Sammy some coffee. Sammy is the uh, Just Dance community developer. She's like the one of the boss ladies. Moose is the other boss lady. And he's a man. So I'm gonna grab her some coffee because I'm sure she's been up since like 2 in the morning. Uh, and then we're gonna head down there and go see what they're doing before the doors open. So yeah! Let's go! I'm so hyped up! And that's her real hair too. Obviously. It's totally natural. It's totally natural. <laughs> Thank you for, for answering my questions. We love you and we think you're the best. So I've got a few questions. Ready. Uh, the first one's from Niji Shoujo. I never say her name right. <laughs> How many songs are featured in the show and will it be the same show at every location or will sets vary? Hey, that was a really great question. So there are actually between 14 and 16 songs. We're still testing out a couple of things. So we could potentially cut a song or two depending on how long they go. While there is a chance we could end up cutting a song here or there, um, the set is staying exactly the same and it goes on tour with us. Turns out the set was actually built in Wells and then it came all the way here to Miami and then it's gonna be heading off to Chicago next week. So to Sendo Kadu, or Kadu. Yeah, Kadu! Hi, Kadu! Are there plans to bring JD Live to more places? So, as many of you know, but we're realizing more and more from all the comments that we saw on YouTube, that this is a pilot, um, meaning we're testing it right now. So while I wish I could say, yes, we're going to be going everywhere in the entire world with Just Dance Live, as of right now, it is a pilot, but we're hoping people are going to love it so much that, yeah, hopefully in the next few years, you're going to see it all around the world. That's our that's our dream. Dancer Girl 2 k or Genesis, asked, are you thinking of doing any other shows this year or maybe next year? So as of right now, the pilot does end at the end of March uh, in Los Angeles, and the plan then is to reassess, see how it did, read everyone's feedback, and then who knows? Maybe it could go back out. I won't lie, I can't make any promises, but uh, the plan right now is just to see how this month goes, which is really scary and really exciting all at the same time. Jason S asked, is there an opportunity for attendants to participate with the dancers? 
There is a lot of opportunities throughout the whole show. Um, Avery is joining us tonight, so she'll probably be able to tell you a bit more about it, but the dancers come on and off the stage the whole time. So yeah, we definitely have a lot of opportunities for players to go join the dancers. It's um, The goal of Just Dance Live is the show really isn't about watching the dancers. The star of the show is you. And what's your favorite part of Just Dance Live? I think my favorite part's the ending, which I don't mean, I don't entirely want to give away, but it is, uh, it's extremely happy. Hey, hey. finger guns. <laughs> Thank you, Sammy, for asking my questions. We love you. Love you guys. Actually have face painting so I'm going to get my face painted I don't know what I'm gonna get but I'm sure whatever I get I'll look fabulous from Just Dance Live, as you can tell, I've got my face painted. I am so pooped. That show was awesome, and I was running around like crazy and like trying to dance and like eating churros at the same time, but it was so much fun, and they, they really did the game right, because they not only had like super accurate costumes, but they had songs like mesh into each other so like if it was like a Halloween song it would mesh into like another Halloween song or like a creepy song and it was it was so great and like a lot more <laughs> I don't want to sound mean I don't want to sound mean I'm sorry but a lot more people showed up than I thought they would there was a lot of people there and not just kids too I mean it was mostly kids like let's be real it was mostly kids um, but there were a lot of adults there it was a really long show it was like two hours but it was really really cool they had a ton of merch they had the face painting they had uh, cardboard cutouts you could put your face in they had a community area where you could play games together I met a lot of cool people the show also had like a ton of competitions and stuff where it got the audience involved and they had the dancers moving around from stage to stage and like it was very <sighs> Ambient, I guess is the right word. Like there was dancing all around you. It was so cool. So I thought it was amazing. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm really tired. But I think there was there was a moment like halfway through the show where I started getting emotional because I was looking all around me and I was like, all these coaches are like brought to life. Like they're real and they're all around me. And like I was like, this is amazing and I can't believe I can't believe how far Just Dance has come since like Just Dance won. So yeah, I'm I'm just I'm really proud of that team. They work so hard and they're so creative and um, I I hope there's more of this to come because this was amazing. Um, but there was also a moment where I was like, I'm in love with a game franchise meant for children. <laughs> What's wrong with me? I don't think it's really meant for children. I think it's meant for everybody to to get up and dance and have fun. So I did just that. And it was a great time, and I'm so glad I got to go. Um, thank you, Ubisoft, for sending me. I've also got some stuff to give away on my Facebook page, um, so I would go check that out if you want to win some of the merch from the from the the, 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 the show. Mwah. I'm going to bed. Good night, forever.